previously on Paradise Cafe. Find out what is making McCollum stink and make it stop before my hotel loses any more money. Whoever broke the seal on the coral, that is who you seek. I think we are all touching it. You're a ghost. They were just messing with us. They could get in all along. Ah! I've just realized the coral seems to be rotten from the inside out. So, Meg, what's it going to be today? A stroll on the beach? Exploring a cove or...? Degreasing the cafe cooker. No, you can. I have up a treat for after. Great. You're going to have a swim? I'm going to have a pressing session with the cafe napkins. I thought you had paperwork. You get a brilliant crease. <laughs> Sweetheart, you really need to get out more. fall off, occupancies down, cost are rising. What do you reckon, Mum? Peach Passion or Cherry Shiraz? You using my lipstick, Abby? I thought you were supposed to be tidying up. I was, until I remembered. We live in a hotel, which has maids. Who work for me, tidying up after my guests, not after my spoiled daughter who's going to have to give up her lazy lifestyle and start earning her keep if the dying coral keeps affecting our bookings. What are you having a go at me for? I didn't kill the coral. I didn't say you did. Yeah. And don't splurge. You may need this next month. All the signs point to us going on an economy drive, and that will include your allowance. I prefer the cherry Shiraz. My real tan's like totally blending in with my fake tan now. Does Halloween come early in this part of the world? Haven't you got lovely stuff? Here. Do you want to buy this so I can get something nice to wear, like you? We've got mirrors. <laughs> Let's go. Lovely place you have here anyway. Probably full of lovely people with loads <laughs> of nice stuff. Much better than the miserable place I'm used to. Is that an ancient island ritual? Yep, it's called Smallest Noise. I've got a ritual too. It's called Get the Cafe Ready for Business. Yep, but we don't all work on fast forward. No, freeze frame's more your thing. You gotta go with the flow, Megan, and the island flow is laid back. My sister doesn't do laid back. I so can do laid back. Prove it. Take the day off. Oh, advantage Robo. Megan to serve. All right. I will. I'll oh, believe it when I see it. I'm sorry, love to chat. Cafe to run. Cute customers. Hi, I'm Robbo. I'll be your waiter for today. Nancy, how do you do? And I mean, 
Megan's not a bad assistant, as long as I keep her motivated. You're so lucky. Having a place like this, and only three of you living upstairs. Where I live, so crowded. Make me a coconut smoothie, Robbo. I'm exhausted. One coconut smoothie for the winner of the shop until you drop a thon. I was trying to cheer myself up with some retail therapy. Well, I think your mum will need therapy when she sees how much you've spent. I like that's any of your business. They'd sold out of pink, so I had to make do with yellow. Why get them at all if you're just making do? Because, Robbo, I was in a shop me happy bitch. You don't get happy unless you shop. Boys just don't understand. <gasps> how dare you! I was only trying them out. Get your own shoes. A thousand years ago, the first seaborn was trapped in an underwater cave. He pushed so hard to free himself, his print was embedded in the rock. The sea wore away the rock, but the mark remained. The thumb of every seaborn since fits the mark. Use the rock to determine which of Ty, Robbo, and Megan is the seaborn. Go! Bring me the seaborn. I want my freedom! Freedom! I knew you couldn't take the whole day off. How can I relax, knowing you were serving sloppy salad? Yeah, I mean, I'd hate to get busted by the carrot, please. Oh, the sugar shakers are at different levels. Let me... No. Oh, it's agony, isn't it? No. I'll tell you what. If you can take the whole day off, I will let you... tidy all my stuff. Everything? Even under the bed? Even under the bed. Working, Megan. Hi, Chloe. No, I'm having the day off. Not sure what to do, though. Hmm. You could listen to some DCs on your high cord. <laughs> Will Robbo manage on his own? He'll be absolutely fine. As long as he remembers to chill the fruit and he gunch the smoothie maker and ignore that girl who showed up this morning. Girl? Nancy. Oh, Chloe, what if she distracts him? He'll never get anything done. Look what I found. I'll get it! Oh. Found it. One good deed deserves another. Do you want to buy my mirror? Mmm, shells and coral? It's not my thing. Oh, I get it. You've run out of money, haven't you? As if. I never run out of money. Of course you don't. <laughs> you don't think I can afford it. I've changed my mind. I'll buy it. and try on all your lovely new clothes first. Don't you dare! Who's gonna stop me? Not you, cos... 
I'm the new Abby, and you're yesterday's girl. If you want a smoothie, Abby, you'll have to wait. Robbo! It's not me, Robbo! Maybe I could give you a hand. Sorry, you look like Abby, but you're obviously an alien imposter. No, seriously, thanks. I can't believe Nancy talked you into buying her mirror. I felt sorry for her. Put it behind the bar, would you? I don't want it to get smashed. Robbo! Robbo! Did you, um, see where Nancy went? She's behind you, go brain. Forget about her. I'm here now. Huh. Robbo! It's pointless. As long as they believe I'm Abby, they won't be able to see or hear you. They won't believe me for long. I'd never do manual labour. How many slices do you get to a pawpaw? Four slices. At the cafe, I insist on ten. Lengthways. Or do you get more widthways? No, not really. What if Robbo's only slicing eight? My car still go through the roof. You're a whiz with the smoothies, Robbo. They're going down a storm. Thanks. What's up with Abby today? I think she just paid me a compliment. Man, I think she likes you. Ew. <laughs> yeah, right. Who cares about Nancy? You got me now. She didn't mean it like that. Chloe! Help! Chloe! Come to our pack, Chloe. Now Megan's taking the day off. Don't worry, Chloe. You're not imagining things. Abby's actually in a good mood for once. <laughs> I'm not always in a bad mood. Table four wants some more of your smoothies, bro. Oh, I am smoking. Woo! <laughs> What are you doing here, Nancy? What have you done with Abby? Enjoying myself. And wouldn't you like to know? You'll get in the way of my seaborne mission. I won't harm your precious mission. You're always escaping from the coral. Well, I want to enjoy the world and have some fun too. Be careful. Don't give us away. growing the mangoes in the time it's taking you to make these smoothies. Nearly ready. I bet your mum doesn't let her staff talk to her like that. Her staff? You mean at the place that she works? Yeah. Where else? I suppose you'd need a lot of staff doing what she does. Right. Um, I thought to have five people gasping for their smoothies. She probably needs all of them to keep things running smoothly. Look, Abby, you don't need to make excuses for your mum. To run a flash hotel, you probably need all the flunkies you can get, right? Rich kid. Think I might pop home to see Mum. Leave her out of this. She's got enough to worry about without some repulsive ghost sliming about. I'll know how to handle your mother. You'll get me grounded. You'll lose me my allowance. <clears throat> Lost your broomstick. Serving? I oh, know. Weird. But she's helping out because you've taken the day off, remember? No. Why is she looking at herself in a mirror? Don't know. Don't care. Why don't you come in and ask her? Oh, oh no. I'm not falling for that one. You nearly did, though, didn't you? I was only pretending. Was not. Was too. I'm still on my day off. And I'm still going to tidy your stuff. We'll see. I am. Um, I found this on the beach.
Come on, Robbo. Let's go. Hang on a moment. He's just looking at this. Where? To put my new clothes away. Robbo! Don't show her where I live! It's busy, Abby. I can't. Of course you can. Say no, Robbo. No! Go on. Keep me company. Ty, I'm walking Abby home. Take over. Me. You can do it, man. Are you sure? You can do this, bro. OK, people, relax. Ty's in charge. No! Ty, are there any more flapjacks? Um, think so. Hang on, I'll have a look. Needs more guava. Get your filthy mitts off my clothes. I feel different today. Like I've suddenly just realised how lucky I am. Like I'm seeing everything for the first time. Including me. Now that would be telling. Wise up, Romeo. She counts her bones back into the box at bedtime. Give us a hand tidying up. You were being laid back today. I am. That's laid front. You got fruit mush in your hair. Stop spying on us. Don't you think Abby's been acting a bit weird today? She's talking to herself in the mirror and she's working. Who knows what goes on in Abby's head? Look, Megan, just relax. Take it easy. Everything's going to be fine. I don't know how you walk in those things. Neither does she. It's easy. I'll show you. Wow! Mum! Mum, help! What happened? Robbo helped. Did he help with the shopping as well? Uh, no. I... I'll wait in the lobby. <laughs> I shopped on my own. Want to see? Uh, maybe later. Don't expect a top-up if you've spent your allowance. Have you finished with my lippy? Sorry I took them without asking. Hey, you tidied up. We're quits. I've had enough of this. When are you going to let me out? When I start behaving like you, taking this unbelievable life for granted, which is never. <laughs> What a mess. Oh, Dad. Why has she brought that back? Dunno. You'll probably say I've had too much sun tie, but once you get to know Abby, she's not such a pain. Oh, yeah. And you've been getting to know her a lot today. <laughs> Not wearing my shoes, Nancy. What's the matter? Scared of falling flat on your face? I'm not scared of anything. What ever? At least you're not ruining them with your crumbly dead feet. Oh, hiya, Meg. Enjoying your day off? Are you kidding? You've left me a stack of coal to organise. But it was already organised. Into the different locations I collected it from. Oh, Dad. I've muddled it all up and ruined your work, haven't I? It's not totally ruined. Still got the coral. 
have to try and work out which bits came from where. I'll help. Probably quicker if I do it myself. You go and enjoy the rest of your day off. I can't enjoy it if I know my organising has disorganised you. Oh, please, Dad, let me help. OK. Yeah. And the pattern almost looks like a thumbprint. Stop flirting with Chloe, Ty. He's not flirting. Let him just finish... Customers him. dying of thirst over here. Thanks for talking me into letting you help. You've done a great job. It's just a shame it's eaten into your day off. It hasn't. It's been fun. I haven't thought about the cafe in ages. Thanks, Dad. Aww. Make the most of it, Nancy. This won't last long. Like, you can do anything about that. I won't have to. The others will suss you first. You may have stolen my life, but you're a long way from stealing my style. Those shoes don't even go with that outfit. Oh, yeah? Well, watch me and weep. Come to see if I'm thirsty, Chloe. I've come to see if you're leaving. Don't get on my case just because you're messing up your mission. You're messing it up, not me. So go. Now. Or I'll tell Ragnar. Don't you threaten me. That'll show him who I am. But what if some spills on you? Who's scared now, Mary Girl? I am. Because you're wrecking my heels, walking like a dizzy giraffe. to laze about, do you? Just because that's what other people like to do. Of course not. Days off are all about doing what you enjoy. Could be sunbathing or skydiving. I've often thought what people do on their days off reflects who they really are. A reflection of who they really are? You're right, Dad. What have you done with Abby? Robo! Leave it under here! Robo! I think it's something to do with the mirror. It is. Hang on, Abby. We'll get you out. Finally. Yeah, but how? I don't know. Try smashing it. <laughs> Well, then, it's been fun. But enough's enough. Didn't think this lot would care about you. But they do. You OK? Yeah, thanks. Abby's back. <laughs> Apart from being forced to watch you cosy up to that bag of bones and listening to you two bad-mouthing me all day. Abby's back. Nancy! Nancy! <laughs> hey. Thanks for setting me free. Anytime. You know, I was only kidding with that cozying up to the bag of bones line, right? Yeah, sure. You meant because I thought she was you, not because you were jealous or anything. Obviously. Why would I be jealous? Mm, crazy. I mean, jealous of what? It's not like we're... Well, don't even go there. As if. <laughs> I gave you that rock to find the seaborn, to give us all freedom, and you let them destroy it? Was 
was Nancy's fault. Don't blame it on me. Ragnar, I never... Enough, Nancy. You got in my way. You failed me, Chloe. You failed us all. Go, while I decide your fate. Aren't even sugar level alert. Life's too short to measure sugar. Not too short to tidy your stuff. Draymond, you never took the whole day off. I totally did. Including the time you were spying on us from the roof. If I wasn't on the roof, then you wouldn't have known where Abby was. We so would have. Why do you always say that? Ty, didn't we know where she was? Yeah. No, you wouldn't. Abby, we told you we knew where you were, right? Cherish your ass. I want you to have it. What's got on you? What's up? Uh, nothing. Just thanks for everything. I love you, Mom. Love you, too. Next time on Paradise Cafe, we are not entertaining ghosts. Shh. Who here would like some entertainment? <laughs> That's going to be a no from me. Ty? Tonight, I'm gonna sing. Smoke! <laughs> Fire! Was that in the charts? I am sorry to be late. Ghosts entertaining other ghosts. That'll be a disaster, or I'm telling you. Know your horrible history? Do you like your games gory? Want to take part in the messiest, silliest, and goriest game show ever? Well, then Horrible History's Gory Games is for you. That's right, our good friend Rattus Rattus is looking for new contestants for the brand new series. To apply, just go to the CBBC website and click on Be On a Show for your chance to get involved. Come on, then, what are you waiting for? Welcome to Friday Download. This November, we're back on the CBBC channel. I've made it to the top. We're bringing you the essential Friday night download. Yes, right. Everything you can possibly need for the week ahead. Talk to me. So, let's get this download started. How are you feeling? Amazing. Awesome. We're ready. Are you? Now it's time for today's gadget. I love that! Friday Download, a brand new series. Fridays at 6 on the CBBC channel.